Hey guys, welcome to another tool review. I guess you could consider this a tool review video. Um, I'm going to show you guys a review and kind of a demonstration of this Alperto. I don't really know how to say that. AU. Alperto. Whatever. This is a portable car jumper. Now, this is not a sponsored video. I've actually been contacted probably at least three or four times by different companies asking if I would do a sponsored uh, review of one of these portable car jumpers. And I really didn't think it'd be something you guys would be interested in. And I thought it'd be kind of like, come off as like I was trying to sell out or some shit like that. But, um, I've been having a lot of issues with my riding lawnmower with the battery and uh, shit like that. And um, it actually isn't the battery. The battery's not the problem, but I thought it was. And I was getting really fed up with it. And my battery tender is here at the shop, which is 20 minutes away from my house. And I was getting tired of fucking with it. And I decided to buy one of these portable car jumpers to use on the lawnmower. And it worked really awesome. But I was so impressed with this product that I thought I would show you guys. Um, I'll give you a nice review on it. Um, but this isn't sponsored in any way, shape, or form. I purchased this product with my money. And um, I'll have a link, an Amazon link in the description if you want to see this product. But this is not sponsored at all. I just thought this product was pretty cool and I thought I'd share it with you guys. Um, the whole package comes in this, you know, pretty small case. You could probably put this in some glove boxes. And, uh, let's open it up. Alright, so here's everything. Um, it's really compact, actually. And you would not believe, or he might believe, but it's pretty damn impressive. This is the, the battery. This is what jumps it. And uh, if I can get it out, this is rated at 600 amps. This has the same amount of power as the battery in my IS300. It is insane. So, uh, this is the guts of it right here. Um, it's also a flashlight. A pretty good flashlight, I might add. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a pretty cool device. Basically, all together, it can jump your car. It's got this flashlight on it. It's got two USB outs right here, so you can charge two devices. Um, it also, also has uh, two more outputs. This is what's really, really cool. So check this out, all right? You can take this cord right here, plug it in, and then it's got all these adapters right here to where you could charge like a laptop or something. Um, this would definitely work on my HP laptop that I have to use the Gretty eManage, but it wouldn't work on my MacBook. But um, yeah, you could charge a bunch of devices with this. So whatever you can charge with USB or with one of these adapters you could use. Um, it comes with this cable, this USB cable that can do uh, Android, iPods, and the new iPhone, which I'll probably never use this, but let's open this here, turn that off. Oh, it strobes, does a SOS kind of shit, and there it is turned off. And it charge, charges pretty quickly too. I'll add that. Um, so yeah, it comes with this. Plug this in here, and then you could charge, you know, your iPhone, your iPhone 5, or whatever, or your Android, anything that takes micro USB. Um, you could charge any any kind of laptop really with this. Um, it's also it also has a car charger, so, so you could plug this in here, charge this in your car, and then plug this here. And then you could charge your laptop while you charge that at the same time, and you wouldn't be draining that. Pretty damn awesome, I must say. I probably won't ever use that feature, but it's pretty awesome. Here is the wall charger for it. Um, 
I charged this, I think it took about an hour to fully charge, maybe a little bit longer. Um, for 600 amps, you know, that's it's pretty quick. It doesn't take that long to charge. And here is what's really important. The actual jumper cables themselves. They can plug in right here. And I think this thing has kind of two modes here. Like if you just hook it up, I think you can just hook it up and it gives some amount of power to the battery, but then you click boost and it like pushes a ton of power to the battery and can help you jump it. So this right here, I'm, it cost me like 80 bucks, I think, and it is pretty damn worth it. And I'm gonna show you why. All right, so this Lexus has been sitting for a while now and the battery is dead. The car will not start. Let's connect this here and see if it can jump start the IS300. So it's not a 100% dead battery, but it's pretty damn close to being dead. We'll click boost on it. And right now it's at 84% battery. And uh, let's see if it'll jump it. Now you can see it 84%. Let's see if it'll jump, and also see how much power it pulls from the battery if it's able to jump it. That was nothing! It's pretty impressive. It jumped the IS300 with no problem at all, and somehow it gained 2% battery, which doesn't make sense. So either the output is wrong, or it's very optimistic or that somehow charged it quickly with the two seconds that it was on when it was running. But that's easy. Jumping this car is easy. Let's go take this to the Supra, which has a completely, completely dead battery and it's in the trunk, so the current's gotta flow further. Let's see if this can jump the Supra, which I'm pretty doubtful. I have a lot of trouble with the Supra, um, even with battery tenders and shit, that car is a motherfucker to jumpstart. So this battery is 100% dead. I forgot to turn the switch off, which I installed this switch so this kind of shit doesn't happen, but I forgot to turn it off and it sat for a couple weeks and the battery died. So this thing's rated for 600 amps and the battery I have in it is rated for 800. So um, if this thing, you know, does what it claims, 600, 600 amps, this should start the car, but I'm really skeptical. This car has a lot of a lot of trouble starting, but <laughs> if this starts it, I will be absolutely amazed. All right, well, I turned it on. Let's see if it starts it. That was very impressive. As you heard, as soon as I hit the boost button to give it a start, it threw all the power on. You heard everything click on, and it actually started. I'm absolutely amazed. So I gotta say, once again, this isn't a sponsored video, but this Alperto portable jumper thing, charger, whatever you wanna call it, it it's, it's a charger and it jumps and it's also a, a flashlight. Um, it's actually pretty awesome. I was really skeptical when I got it, but I've used it on my lawnmower, I've used it on the Supra, I used it on here, and you know, it works really awesome. And the thing that I like, which is probably the biggest selling point to me, is the case is smaller than the case of jumper cables that I have in this car and my Subaru. And sometimes jumper cables, you know, they sometimes are too short. And uh, you know, this could definitely replace the jumper cables. You put this in the case and keep the case in your trunk or in your back seat or whatever. It takes up less room and it can jump start a car. If you're stranded and no one else can jump you, you can use this. So, you know, it saves space and it's probably safer because if your battery's dead and no one's around, then how the hell are you gonna get a jump? So for the 80 bucks or whatever it costs me to get this, I think it's well worth the investment. Um, I'm gonna keep it at my house to use on my lawnmower and on the Supra, but 
You know, I almost want to buy another one of these just to keep in the Supra and get rid of jumper cables. No, I just... There's only, and other than the money aspect, there's really almost no reason to not have this in your car. You know, it can charge so many devices, it can charge your laptop, it's a flashlight, it's a power bank, you know, it could really save your ass if you leave your lights on or something. So, I highly recommend it. If you want to pick this up or look more into it, I'll have a link to this one in the description of the video. Um... Yeah, that's it. I just I really like this product and I thought I'd share it with you guys. So hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you like these kinds of videos and want me to review more products, let me know. Um, if there's something that you want to see me buy and review, let me know. Um, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. And uh, please like, share, subscribe, all that. Love, love it, and maybe even kiss the screen or something if you really love it. And uh, I'll see you next time.